Hi welcome to my channel Creative Zone. Today I am going to discuss about normal residence, domestic territory and national income aggregates. Question define and discuss the term, normal residence of a country. Answer, it is not necessary that normal resident of a country is also a citizen of that country. A person may be a normal resident of one country even when he is a citizen of other country. Normal residents of a country include citizens and institutions of the country who normally reside in the country and whose center of economic interest lies in the country. Citizens of other nations who continue to live in the country beyond a period of one year and whose center of economic interest lies in the country. For example, if an Indian is living in USA for more than one year and his center of economic interest lies in that country, he would be deemed as a normal resident of USA even when he continues to be a citizen of India. Citizens of a country working in international organizations like World Bank and IMF or foreign embassies located in that country. For example, an Indian working in the World Bank office located in New Delhi would be considered as a normal resident of India. Citizens of a country who are living abroad, but not for a period exceeding one year and whose center of economic interest lies in their home country. Border workers are persons who cross the border between two countries daily or regularly in order to work in one country are the residents of the country in which they live, not of the country in which they are working. Officials, diplomats, and members of the armed forces of a foreign country are treated as the normal residents of the country to which they belong, and not of the country in which they are employed. A person or institutions of the country who normally reside in a country even if more than one year but his economics does not lie in that country or even if a person of other nations who continue to live in the country beyond a period of one year and whose center of economic interest does not lie in that country, he will be considered as normal residents of that country on which he has economics interest but not the country where he resides more than one year. Question, discuss who are not included in normal residents of a country. Answer, the following are not included in normal residents of a country, the foreigners who visit a country for traveling, recreation, holidays, medical treatment, studies, conferences, sports, etc. The officials, diplomats and members of armed forces of a foreign country posted in the country. International organizations located in the country. Crew members of foreign vessels. Foreigners who are employees of non-resident enterprises and who have come to the country for purpose of installing machinery in these enterprises. All these people will be treated as non-residents as generally they stay for less than one year in the concerned country and their center of economic interest does not lie in it. Question. Discuss the components of domestic territory. Answer. The following are the components of domestic territory. Territory lying within the political frontiers including territorial waters of a country. Ships and aircrafts operated by residents of the country across different parts of the world. For example, Indian ships moving between Japan and Korea regularly or passenger planes operated by Air India between England and Canada are a part of the domestic territory of India. Fishing vessels. Oil and natural gas rigs and floating platforms operated by the residents of the country in the international waters are engaged in extraction in areas in which the country has the exclusive right of exploitation. For example, the fishing boats operated by Indian fishermen in the international waters of the Indian Ocean are a part of the domestic territory of India. Embassies consulates and military establishments of the country located abroad. For example, the Indian Embassy in the United States of America is a part of the domestic territory of India and the Embassy of USA in India is a part of the domestic territory of United States of America. 
It may be noted in this context that domestic territory does not refer to the areas of ownership beyond political frontiers of a nation. It only refers to areas of operation where our persons, our goods and our capital can circulate freely to serve our economic interest. Thus, factor income generated within the domestic territory of a nation amounts to domestic income. Q. Discuss the components of net factor income from a broad NFIA. ANS. The following are included in NFIA, net compensation of employees. It is the difference between compensation of employees received by resident workers, temporarily employed abroad and a similar payment made to non-resident workers who are employed temporarily within the domestic territory of a country. Compensation of employees refers to payments made by the employers to the employees both in cash and kind. It also includes payments made by the employers on behalf of the employees like contribution to employees provident fund. Net income from property and entrepreneurship other than retained earnings of resident companies abroad it is the difference between the income in the form of rent, interest and profit received by the residents of a country and similar payments made to the rest of the world. 3. Net retained earnings of resident companies abroad. It is the difference between the retained earnings of resident companies located abroad and retained earnings of foreign companies located in the domestic territory of a country. Gross domestic product at market price GDPMP, it includes factor incomes of normal residents' income of the country plus factor incomes of non-residents who resides in the domestic territory of that country. Gross domestic income equals normal residents' factor income of the country plus non-residents' factor income to those who reside and produce in the domestic territory of that country. Gross national product at market price GNPMP, normal residence factor income of the country plus non-residence factors income, who reside in the domestic territory of that country but their economic interests do not there in that country OR, GDPMP, plus are normal residents who resides in abroad more than one year but their economic interests do not there in that country OR factor income received from abroad by our normal residents, non-residence income who resides in the domestic domestic territory of that country more than one year in our domestic territory but their economic interests do not there in our country or factor income paid to non-residents of our country means the foreigners. In other words, gross national product at market price GNPMP, normal residence factor income of the country plus, are normal residents who resides in abroad more than one year but their economic interests do not there in that country or factor income received from abroad by our normal residents, non-residents income who resides in the domestic territory of that country more than one year in our domestic territory but their economic interests do not there in our country or factor income paid to non-residents of our country means the foreigners or non-residents factors income, who reside in the domestic territory of that country but their economic interests do not there. GNPMP equals GDPMP plus factor income from abroad. Factor income to abroad, GNPMP equals GDPMP plus NFIA. Read the points carefully. 